Hi, let's take a look at how easy it is to assign colors to an assembly of parts within GrabCAD Print. Here's my assembly. It's a gear cube and we've got lots of elements here that make up this part. I've already made a couple of color assignments here. We've got two digital materials. Digital materials are Stratasys pre-mixed colors, predefined. So this is a digital material of Vero Cyan Vivid, Vero Pure White and Vero Yellow and that's easily obtainable from this drop-down list. So that's one assignment and then here is another assignment and that's one from the uh, Vero Cyan Vivid and Vero Yellow Vivid selections. Next I have here a Vero Cyan on its own and that's indicated by this being selected here and the rest of the material selections are currently at the default white. So if you import a part into GrabCAD and you have color uh, options it will default to white and then you can make different assignments there so let's start off by taking a look at the color picker and I'm going to choose one of my parts here and I will go and uh, make a color assignment and that looks pretty fantastic now moving on let's do a select another part and this time I'm going to assign a hex value so here's the hex value for white I can get rid of that and bring in hex value for teal now let's say I wish to use uh, the uh, assign a color via RGB I can go here to my RGB window and let's put in an RGB for a nice gray Okay, and that's automatically updated. And last, let's take a look at assigning a Pantone color. My favorite Pantone color is Process Blue. Now, in order to get there, I can either scroll down through here and choose a Pantone color, or I can enter in the Pantone number or name in the search bar here. Let's type in Process, and there we go. Straight up, Process Blue. Okay, now if I wish to uh, let's say I wanted to assign uh, this grey that we had as an RGB to uh, this corner here I can click on my RGB instead of entering in the number from scratch again I can click on the selection and I can go copy properties and then when I click on this part here can right click again and go paste properties and those assignments will be ported over directly and that works for everything transparencies color um, sure values all uh, assignments that I would have made so the last thing that I want to do is I want to select here the uh, matte mode as this is uh, an assembly and that will uh, give me a uniform surface finish let's arrange this tray and let me make some duplicates of the part let me uh, put in uh, three parts here and now I can go save the project carry out an estimate or send the file directly to print fantastic